Ford didn't exactly get very good press when they brought the Escort out about a year ago. It was criticised for having bland looks, a mediocre chassis and one of the worst ranges of engines to be found outside Warsaw. Well, launched here is the RS2000. While manufacturers usually aim to launch a complete range all at the same time, the Escort has had to wait for a year for a version with some guts. A version that could give the rest of the lineup some much needed pizzazz. This car represents Ford's first chance to show us that the standard Escort was a momentary aberration and that really they know what they're doing. First things first, the chassis, and it's all good news. It feels like a sporty car should, especially on these wonderful seats. Steers like a sporty car should, and the handling is completely Gary proof. It also has Gary proof looks. Ford, praise be, has resisted the temptation to go over the top, limiting any styling excursions to abrasive bulges in the bonnet, alloy wheels, and a discreet rear spoiler. But then they've spoiled what is so nearly an excellent package with a flawed engine. It delivers the goods quite well, but at high revs, it's noisy and harsh. My recommendation to you is take a test drive before you buy, just to make sure you can live with it. My recommendation to Ford is rather more simple. Come on!